Hi guys, Johnny Gerard here. Man, you know I heard that F-16 fighter jet crashed over there by Ellington Field. That's right over here by Houston. South of Houston by NASA, as a matter of fact. Crashed this F-16 jet. Fully armed, full of fuel. Thank God the pilot ejected, right? They took him to an undisclosed hospital for medical treatment. Apparently he survived. But you know, they evacuated the whole surrounding area uh, because they were afraid one of these air-to-air -air missiles that was on this F-16 was gonna uh, blow some stuff up after crashing the plane and it was full of jet fuel. You know, that stuff, man, shoot. So right now the, the federal government is over there cleaning the mess up, getting this thing bombs off of the jet, getting the fuel out of the jet, trying to pump the fuel out, clean the area up so they can get all these people back from Ellington Field area back to their businesses, back to their homes, and back on the roads and the surrounding area. I, I can't tell you how big the area was that they evacuated, but I know it was a pretty big area. I saw it on the news. Ellington Field it ain't far from here. I'm, I'm real close to downtown. I live in Houston, you know. But that's way out there by NASA on the far reaches of Houston, 30, 40 miles from here almost, you know, but on the edge of Houston. So anyway, right now I'm cooking up some chicken. Y'all want to check it out, man? Huh? Check out some chicken strips? All right, hang on. All right, let's see what we got going on in here. Oh, man, that looks good. Woo! Holy moly. I got two different seasonings on there. Look at that stuff sizzle, man. Oh, boy. Yeah, buddy. Okay. You know, just to let you know, I got a couple different seasonings on there. I shared this on my other channel, too, but this is a little bit different video. I shared, I put this one on three of it. That's Alamo Cattle Special Formula. Real good stuff right here. The other one I put on there is called Chupacabra Rub. It's by Dos Gringos. This is pretty good stuff right here. It's pretty spicy, but it ain't real hot. You know what I mean? Tastes good. Just real good spicy stuff, man. So anyway, uh, another thing that I want to talk to you guys a little bit about right now is, that, is I need your financial support to help keep these channels running. Listen, I'm not looking to make any money making YouTube videos. I am not going to get rich. I'm not looking to even make a living. All my bills are paid, people. I don't need help with that. What I need help with is the the monthly operating cost in order to produce videos, okay? Sorry, y'all. I, pa I paused the video real quick because I had to flip my chicken. But anyway, listen. It cost me 200 bucks to produce these videos every month. That's my internet connection and my supplies and the money it cost me to get back and forth to where I can find a laptop or, or a desktop computer. I live in a stack and pack apartment complex. I don't talk to my neighbors all that much. Most of them are freaking crazy because, you know, I live in HUD housing. This is cheap housing right here, you know, because I'm broke, man. I used to make a bunch of money welding, but I, I live in HUD housing. I do, man. I really do. And I, I, I post these videos off a handheld device. So I just want, just, you know, I do it at my kitchen table. So I'm just being upfront and honest with you guys. I want help with my operating cost every month so I don't have to shut down every month for two or three weeks and go try to find some money here and there to try to make the cost so I can get my internet connection on again and go make some more videos. You know what I mean? So I want to continue to do that. I want to continue.